I think one of the most interesting things about the whole of this World Policy Conference, and congratulations again to Thierry and the whole of the team in terms of having reached this remarkable milestone of this being the 10th conference, has been that right from the beginning, from the message from His Majesty Mohammed VI, right at the beginning of this program, until the session on the European Union just a few minutes ago, we've heard the message over and over again about the centrality of Africa in the global discourse, on the importance of incorporating Africa not only into Morocco's perspective of its center of gravity in the global landscape, but in the context of Europe's relationships and in the context of the entire system of global governance. What we're trying, going to try and do this morning is get an African perspective on how to realize that particular vision of Africa playing its proper role both in the context of global development and global advancement and in the context of global governance. And we have an absolutely extraordinary team in a certain sense for this purpose. We have two former prime ministers. We have a former minister of finance and the economy. And we have a former minister of foreign affairs who has been engaged in a significant amount of conflict mediation and conflict resolution across the continent. So every dimension of the developmental narrative is actually present on this panel. Everyone here has had to deal with the challenges of development. Some have had to deal with the challenges of resolving conflicts to enable development to take place in its aftermath. And we have a variety of perspectives, two from Senegal, one from Benin, and one from our host country of Morocco. So without any more, I'm going to pass it over to our panelists to be able to give you an appropriate perspective in respect of this challenge. 